Hey friends, welcome back to my channel. Today, we are going to be talking about something that is very close to my heart, which is, are you too old to break into the tech industry or to learn how to code? This is something I'm super passionate about because um, I had these thoughts when I was starting out with coding and getting into tech. And recently I did on my IG, I did a ask me anything and I got a concerning amount of questions that were just this, am I too old to break into the tech industry? Before we go any further though, make sure to hit that subscribe button for more tech and coding related videos. Shout out to some of these subscribers here. As always, I'm sending you all my love. You are amazing and I just love our community we uh, have built together. Before we jump right into this topic, I want to share with you some staggering statistics. Did you know that in the US, only 47% of high schools actually offer computer science classes? That's pretty crazy if you ask me. For me, I think computer science should be taught like math is or sciences. It's something that we all should be exposed to and uh, learn at a young age to at least have the option to decide if it's for us or not for us. Also, out of the 219 countries out there, there are only 73% that are either piloting computer science in school or doing nothing at all. That is why I am super excited to announce our sponsor today. Dot Tech, along with Namecheap, are donating proceeds, not only 10%, not 50%, but 100% of sales proceeds to code.org. That's insane. And I'm so excited to hear when I hear these things because as someone who didn't have the opportunity to get exposed to computer science until later in life, hearing that these proceeds are helping others is just amazing. I can tell you firsthand, if I would have had some computer science courses during high school, I definitely wouldn't have waited so long to get into it. And I know this topic is so important to so many people and can resonate with so many people who have had similar experiences. And that's where it comes in that you don't experience computer science till later in life or kind of explore it. And then the question comes up, well, can I still get into this? Am I too old? The quick answer is you are never too old, but we will get into that further in a minute here. Because the quick answer to this is everyone should have the opportunity to learn how to code or at least have a basic understanding of computer science when they are growing up. One of the things that I think is so important is as tech is essentially building such a large part of our future and solving such big problems, we need to ensure we have a diverse group of people solving these problems. And that goes back to why I am so passionate, I mean why I do this channel, that everyone should have the opportunity to explore different careers in tech if they have missed out on an opportunity to get into computer science, to not let that stop you. And if you feel the same way as me and have a similar experience and want to encourage others um, by supporting them, make sure to go to go.tech slash tiffintech to support others in their tech journey. Also, I linked it in my bio, so go in the description below and uh, check it out. As I mentioned earlier in this video, I did an IG kind of Q&A, ask me anything a while ago, and I was so shocked to see how many people were asking, is 30 years old too, too late in life to start a business, to get into tech? Uh, and I had multiple of these questions from different people, and it, was, it blew my mind because I never had thought of it like that in the sense that I work with people who are getting into tech in their 40s, 50s, um, and beyond. I mean, 40s and 50s usually, but you, it could go beyond. And I was really concerned when I got asked these questions because it really highlighted to me that so much of society, so many people still view tech and the tech industry as a young person's industry. That if you missed the boat, you didn't get a chance to study computer science, it's your opportunity to break into this industry is gone. And that is completely false. Uh, as someone who joined the tech industry, transitioned from fashion and modeling into tech at a later, when I say later age, I was just in my 20s, but later than a lot of the average person gets into computer science, um, I can tell you firsthand that there is not one path to getting into this industry. Not only that, but that's the beauty of it. There shouldn't be just one path. What I mean by that is, if everyone came from the exact same experience of going to computer science to getting a job in tech or whatever it is, it's gonna be kind of boring. It's not, everyone's going to still have some unique experiences, but when 
One of my favorite parts about being in the tech industry is that everyone comes from such diverse backgrounds, whether it be they went to a coding boot camp, computer science, self-taught, maybe they come from a marketing background or so much more. And when you come from different backgrounds, these experiences, even from past jobs or past education, you will still bring into the tech industry and you can contribute that. Even if you don't think you directly can, you, you definitely can. And going back to, am I too old to break into the tech industry? I also want to highlight that as you continue to get older, you gain more experiences, more networking uh, opportunities probably have come your way. And hopefully you've learned a lot more about yourself along the way. So that when it comes to you want to switch industries or break into the tech industry specifically, you can utilize and lean on uh, your support system, your network while you are doing that. I can tell you firsthand as someone who has been on the side of hiring more junior uh, developers in the past, you don't have to be a specific age. I don't, I mean, obviously you can't, no one can ask you your age, but to even if you look a bit older, no one's going to think twice. And if they do, it's a company you definitely do not want to work for anyways. There are definitely more challenges that can come sometimes if you are older breaking into the tech industry. I definitely want to highlight and recognize this such as uh, you have a family, you have a mortgage, bills are piling up, you can't necessarily drop everything and code 24-7 or go to a coding boot camp. And I want to highlight that if that is your scenario, don't let that be the reason to stop you. You can definitely spend an hour a day or a few hours a week learning how to code or there's so many other roles in the tech industry. I'm just honing in on coding. But don't let that stop you that you can't completely drop everything and go back to school. Some of the best developers I have worked with, some of the best people I have worked with in the tech industry don't come from a traditional computer science background. That being said, of course, if the opportunity was there when we were in high school or middle school. It would be so much easier to do that. Um, and I definitely think that it's one of those things that more schools need to get into the high school and middle school curriculum. Uh, I think it should be standardized. So we're not uh, having to kind of relearn these things at a later stage in life. I really wanted to make this video and talk to you about, kind of give you a wake up call that it's never too late to get into the tech industry um, because I just, I couldn't believe how many questions I was getting asked of people who thought they were too old to break into this industry. And I think, you know, Hollywood and society puts this lime or this bright light on tech founders such as people who, you know, founded Facebook or Instagram or all these young tech founders. But if you dig a little deeper, you will quickly see that that is such a small percentage of tech founders. There are some that are in their 50s, 60s and beyond. And it doesn't have to be this young person industry. And it really shouldn't because people from different ages can bring so much to the plate. So I hope if you gain anything from this video, it is that you do not have to pass on the tech industry just because you didn't get the opportunity to study computer science or take computer science courses at, in high school or any age. Obviously, we need to do better as a society to get uh, computer science courses in schools at a younger age, but please do not let that be the reason that stops you from going after your dreams, breaking into the tech industry. It's probably the fastest growing industry and making the hugest impact on our future. So we need to ensure that people from all experiences, all backgrounds are getting into this industry. So we are solving problems, building different technology in a way that is inclusive for everyone. So if you are someone who's a later age getting into tech, I say, please go for it. We need you. We want you. And don't let any self-doubt stop you. Thank you all for watching my video. Make sure to hit the subscribe button for more tech and coding related content. Leave in the comments other videos you want to see. And I will see you all soon. Thanks, everyone.